Like and subscribe right now or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Nature at first glance may appear to be a peaceful place, but in reality, the natural world is a brutal dance of life and death. In response, many animals have developed interesting and surprising defense mechanisms to defend themselves from their predators. Today, we're looking at 10 fatal ways animals protect themselves. Wait till the end to see how a crab uses boxing to fight off predators. Number 10. Exploding Ant Let's start with an insect we see everywhere. Ants are just amazing, but there's one that is very sinister in a most unusual way. Colobopsis saundersi, or exploding ant, as it's commonly known, is an ant species endemic to Malaysia and Brunei. As you'd have guessed from the name, just like soldiers on the front line or pawn in chess, this ant species protects its colony by blowing itself up in a process called autothysis. This is made possible by how the ant's body is structured. It has huge poison-filled glands that run throughout the length of its body. So when faced with a seemingly stronger adversary sure to kill it, the worker ant resorts to exploding to save the colony. It aggressively contracts its abdominal muscles to set off a chain of steps that ends with the mandibular glands bursting. The burst glands release their contents, which is a sticky secretion that irritates, entangles, and immobilizes a nearby enemy. This way, the soldier gives their life for the greater good. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works. Number 9. The Potato Beetle Don't be deceived by the cute name of this insect, as it is one of the most disgusting defense mechanisms in the world. You would probably agree that one way of making sure people don't come near you is by covering yourself in your own feces. Yes, we know that sounds disgusting, but we're pretty sure that it would work. We haven't met anyone who has tried it. But in the animal kingdom, many tiny critters use their feces to defend themselves from predators. The potato beetle loves its own feces, and it's not afraid to flaunt it. To defend itself from any would-be predator, it smears its feces all over its body, kind of like a suit of armor, but poop. Aside from looking and smelling disgusting, there is another very lethal reason why animals avoid eating the potato beetle. The poop is poisonous. It just so happens that this beetle's favorite food is a plant called nightshade, an extremely poisonous plant. So following the idea of you are what you eat, the feces of this beetle contains the toxins of the nightshade plant. To put it in perspective, chewing on a single leaf of this plant can effectively kill a person. Number 8. Blue Ringed Octopus of Death You would be forgiven for thinking how cute this creature is at first glance. The blue ringed octopus looks perfectly innocuous. Just look at it. How cute! Its psychedelic coloring and pint-sized packaging make it seem more adorable than alarming. But don't let its cuddly exterior fool you or be the reason to go and touch it. This tiny octopus can kill you. And quickly. We're not kidding. If you catch them outside of their cozy hiding spots, it's easy to see how the animal gets its name. When threatened, the bright blue rings appear all over its body as a warning signal to potential predators. The blue ringed octopus's venom is in a league of its own. Its venom is 1,000 times more powerful than cyanide, and this golf ball-sized powerhouse packs enough venom to kill 26 humans within minutes. It's no surprise that it's called one of the most dangerous animals in the water. What makes it a bigger threat is the fact that it's so small you cannot see it coming. Number 7. Sea Cucumbers You must be thinking, Sea Cucumber sounds like an adorable name. What is it doing in this list? Well, it does sound cute. And they also look like they're the least intimidating creatures you'll ever see in your life. But if a sea cucumber is attacked, or at least feel threatened, it has all manner of defense mechanisms to ensure its survival. Their ability sounds like something out of Marvel Comics. First off, they can change from a solid form to a liquid form, allowing them to escape into the tiniest of cracks. They can also disassemble themselves into many tiny pieces, fooling any would-be predator that they're already dead then reassemble themselves again when the danger's passed. But their most impressive and deadly defense mechanism is the ability to expel their guts through their anus, exposing their toxic intestines to the attacker, giving it a mouthful of poison as a fitting punishment for attacking this seemingly harmless creature. Number 6. Spanish Ribbed Newt 
Amphibians are one of the more innocent creatures out there. They look evil, but they aren't that big of predators. In fact, they had to evolve a number of defense mechanisms against bigger predators. But of all amphibian anti-predator mechanisms, the Spanish rib newt takes the cake. In addition to some very weird skin, this little amphibian possesses a bizarre defense tactic. When faced with a threat, the newt projects its ribs outside its body wall, turning them into sharp, poisonous spines, giving a whole new meaning to the phrase, concealed weapons. If a predator tries to bite the newt or pick it up using its mouth, the newt's ribs act like poisonous barbs, injecting a poisonous, milky substance secreted from its skin into the mouth of the predator, which can cause pain and death, too, in some cases. Imagine being able to take out your ribs and use them as a weapon. Sounds fun to us. What about you? Number 5. The Electric Eel Have you heard of the saying, a shocking offense is the best defense? In the case of the famous electric eel, it's 100% correct. Electric eels use their high voltage electricity for multiple reasons. When prey have been detected, eels use high voltage to cause immobility by inducing sustained, involuntary muscle contraction. Once grasped in the eel's jaws, difficult prey is often shocked by sandwiching them between the two poles of the eel's powerful electric organ. The resulting concentration of the high voltage discharge delivered at high rates causes the prey to become immobile. For self-defense, the electric eels also leap from the water to directly electrify threats. They use high voltage not only as a weapon, but also to efficiently track fast-moving prey. In conclusion, these creatures are way ahead of humans. Number 4. The Golden Poison Frog This frog goes by many names, the Golden Dart Frog, Golden Frog, Golden Poison Arrow Frog. They're native to coastal Colombia and are usually small with brightly colored skin, so it's very easy to spot them. The Golden Poison Frog common name is a reference to the yellow color in this species. Colorful as the skin might be, don't make the mistake of touching it. The frog's defensive poison is stored here. The skin's entire surface is covered by an alkaloid toxin that is fatal to any animal unfortunate enough to try ingesting this frog. The toxin affects the ability of the nerves to transmit impulses, which leaves the muscles in a contracted state. This can cause heart failure and eventually death, even in humans. The poison can hang on the skin for years, even when the frog isn't ingesting food that directly aids in its synthesis. But just how lethal is this poison? It's probably one of the most dangerous toxins around, albeit rare. On average, the alkaloid toxin can kill about 10,000 mice or between 10 to 20 humans. And that's just a milligram of poison. For a gram, you'll be looking at about 15,000 human deaths. Scared? You should be. Number 3. Hagfish do you know anyone who is 300 million years old? Yeah, I would guess not. Most of the animals that old have perished, let alone humans. But there is one creature that old who lurks at the bottom of the ocean, the hagfish, one of the ugliest and oldest creatures found in the water. Its body is made up of velvet smooth skin with no scales, and it has a skull with no spine. Its wrinkled skin might look disgusting to you, but the weirdest feature of the hagfish is its mouth which looks like it's out of Alien vs Predator movie. Hagfish is one of the most interesting and disgusting defense mechanisms out there. When dealing with a threat, it releases a nasty slime. The slime sends the predator into a fit as it coughs up the substance, trying to prevent suffocation, which usually leaves enough time for the slime eel to escape. This is what 300 million years of evolution does to you. And with that, it's now time for today's subscriber pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber. If you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might even feature it in a future video. Number 2. Blood and Chemical The Texas Horned Lizard is one of the most unusual reptiles out there. It can be easily distinguished from all other lizards by a combination of a short, squat body, two very large horns at the back of the head, and a short, pointed tail. But their defense mechanism is the most unusual factor. When under threat, they close their eyes and the eyelids appear to inflate. They then squirt a directed stream of blood from the sinuses in their eye cavity toward the predator. It repels the predator and helps the lizard to run away. Next, we have the bombardier beetle. This insect has the infamous ability to synthesize and release rapid bursts of stinky, burning hot liquid from its rear end. These noxious emissions can kill other insects or startle potential predators into backing off. These chemical bombs are the source of their name, bombardier beetles. Number 1. 
the boxer crab. You might have seen many weird defense mechanisms in the animal kingdom, but we're sure you haven't heard of this one. The pom-pom boxer crabs are like any other crabs, with the addition of boxing gloves. And where do they get these gloves, you ask? Well, they use sea anemone, a predatory animal that almost looks like a plant. You see, the relationship between these two is very unusual, but heartwarming. These crabs pick up and use the anemone in each claw. This colorful display serves as a natural deterrent to predators, and when directly threatened, the crab will utilize the sea anemone in a forward punching movement toward the aggressor, hence the name, the boxer crab. The sea anemone's stinging tentacles serve as the ultimate defense mechanism for the crab. In exchange for this amazing defense, boxer crabs feed their helpful partners. What an unusual but amazing friendship. Which one of these animals did you find the most interesting? Let us know in the comments, and if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.